warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and ha. Okay, today I'm going to explain about lipid. Okay, for your information, lipid also in the first chapter of uh, biology subject in matriculation. Uh, but lipid is the third subtopic. Okay, so what you should know for lipid. Okay, okay, lipid. So when we talk about lipid, the first thing you should know, of course, about the general information. What is general information that you know about lipid? Okay, first, okay, lipid is organic compound. Why it's organic compound? Because it composed of carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. So any molecule that consists of carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen, they call as organic compound. Okay. So Okay, second, the thing that you need to know about lipid, lipid is energy source. But the energy is twice greater compared to carbohydrate because the lipid will consist of high number of CH bond. Okay, the second thing about lipid, of course, the types of lipid. Okay, so we have three types of lipid. The first one is called triglyceride. Second is phospholipid. And the third one is Steroid. So, okay. okay. The first type of lipid, okay, we're going to explain about triglyceride. So, triglyceride, it composed of one glycerol and three fatty acid. Okay, phospholipid is the second type of a lipid. Phospholipid will consist of first one glycerol two fatty acid one phosphate group and it may consist of one polar group okay so in the drawing if you see the drawing and the drawing asks you to label Okay, the upper one here, this is referred to polar group. Example is choline. Second, this is referred to phosphate group. And this is referred to glycerol. And this two is referred to fatty acid. For phospholipid, you need to remember the importance. Phospholipid is the main component of our plasma membrane. So, it's very important. Every of us uh, have the phospholipid because our membrane is made up by phospholipid by layer. Okay. So, the steroid, it is composed by four fused carbon ring. So the carbon ring will fuse together and it may form a steroid structure. So for steroid, it can be divided into two, which is cholesterol and testosterone. For cholesterol, okay, the importance of cholesterol, it is also the main component in our plasma membrane. Other than that, cholesterol is also a precursor in our body. Uh, it will influence our health. For example, it will cause the arthrochlorosis. Okay, and for testosterone, it is a uh, it is a very important hormone for men because it will help uh, for secondary development in male 
and it is also involved in spermatogenesis process.